Hello everyone, this is Nelson J. Megan and in this episode we are going to look at the login window for the NECO 2024 and the login is a simple process you just log in once on the system and it, and it stays there are certain problems that might arise but you would have to solve them so to log in we would need to launch our software for a start so if you launch your software so this is what you have open and you see what they ask is the school number and how do I get my login? Okay, the login, if I put a school number I'm working on, so, um, so this is a school I'll be working on. The first option that comes up is to download the school details. I'll click yes. So the username is the email you use to log into the school. then the password is the password you use to log into the school as well okay when i say log into the school i mean on the y portal on the neko portal sorry neko.gov.ng there is a place where schools can log into their online portals this is an internal examination so you see ssc internal dot <coughs> neco dot gov to range that is the portal for each school so every school on the neco website or on the neco system can be able to log into this very portal so I'll just proceed, that is after I verified the information. So this is our dashboard, the one I was talking about. And as you can see, the top of the dashboard shows uh, government secondary school, Gembo, and then uh, the center number, that is what shows on the title bar 2024 SSC. Then the logout button, we are still on our dashboard. And on the dashboard, you can see all students or biometric captured or not captured or uploaded students or pending upload. So this is what shows it. And you also have ideas, uh, options to import candidates from a different system or export them to a different system. You can add a new candidate and this is in terms of registration. Then the register button uh, tab will take you to this place where you have list of students registered on the school then an option to enter a new candidate so this is the registration form then biometric capture in this place you would be able to see the list of students who have completely entered their name their subject and their image so this list will appear here and then you can be able to capture the biometric remember with neko it's the 10 fingers then the report is where you generate the report for each school and some of the reports are submitted to the neko state office while others are, are used within the school we have the validation list the candidate photo cards and the entry schedule the subject analysis all these are required for you then the upload is the location where you upload after you have made payment to neko and it's simple enter the username and the password then the cast 3 is the location where you would enter the third year ca for each school and that happens uh, uh, sometime after all the uploads have been made 
make always create a timeline you can be able to view the current timeline on their website then we have the restore if you have lost the the system you were working on after uploading the students remember it must be after uploading the students you can restore your data from the online portal back to this current system you have installed this of your remember the username and the password and the requirement so this is it for neko 2024 and this is what we are going to be working on so as always if our video has been helpful to you.